Council program and its endeavors. We'll start off with our agenda. It includes our options for retail, which include um, our HEB program, our United Healthcare program, Walmart, Aetna, and what we call our grassroots retail program as well. We'll review the tools for success by visiting thebrokerageinc.com. We'll also talk about contracting, the certification process, and a successful strategy for sales. So as we get started, let's talk about our first partner, which is HEB. They have a really nice website where you can go and take a look at their pharmacy and health departments. They allow for their clients to refill prescriptions at this site, um, check if their refill order is ready for pickup. They can transfer prescriptions as well as request new prescription information, and then their savings as such as um, their $4 generic a list of drugs are there as well. They have a section that talks about HEB um, health or being healthy at HEB, diabetic care, and even frequently asked questions. So we would encourage you guys to share this with your clients if you're working the HEB partnership when you're at your retail kiosk table setup. And if you are interested in the HEB opportunity, it is across the state of Texas. Um, we have products featuring with the United Healthcare Company, both their Medicare portfolio um, offers a solution of, of products ranging from um, low income subsidy to that of traditional Medicare and Medicare Advantage programs. Once we cross into the affordable health care um, later on this year, you'll also see that there will be plan options there as well. They have Blue Cross Blue Shield, um, Medicare portfolio items throughout um, Texas, as well as Aetna and Coventry. And depending on where you're located in Texas, they also offer Baylor, Scott, and White. So if you're centrally located, such as um, Austin, Waco, Colleen, um, Temple area, just to name a few. You may have the Baylor, Scott, and White program that's available in your area. They also offer an assortment of Medicare supplements and standalone prescription drug plans that here at the brokerage we can have you um, align with. So if you're interested in growing your portfolio or want to add anything to your portfolio, simply give us a call here at the brokerage and we can help you um, set that up. In order to qualify for the HEB retail program, you must have a state license, of course. You must be contracted with the Brokerage Inc. directly on the products in which you represent, such as the Medicare Advantage products, the prescription drug plans, the Medicare supplement plans, and when applicable, the Affordable Care Act plans as well. Now here in the Houston market um, where I'm located, we actually are able to sell the Memorial Hermann product currently for the affordable health care plan. So again, if you're looking to take advantage of an HEB store opportunity, we actually began our um, store opportunity in the month of March and it's going until the end of July. So you still have an opportunity to get in on an HEB if you like. As I mentioned, the carrier portfolio certifications are required, so you must be credentialed and certified um, to participate in the stores. They do require event filings and activity reporting, and we can go into greater detail with that as well. There's no cost to you as an agent to participate with the stores, uh, for HEB that is, so it's a really good opportunity to have yourself outfitted in your community. Um, to be the insurance representative that people kind of come to once they enter the HEB location. Um, the support is through both HEB and the Brokerage Inc. The hours of operation are set currently during this SEP, which is a special en enrollment period, <clears throat> from Tuesdays and Thursdays from 9 a.m. until 1 p.m. And additional days and hours may be selected as long as they're approved by the store manager. As I mentioned, the Medicare program, currently the SCP marketing is going from current, which started March 1st, and it will go throughout July 31st. So depending on um, if you're already in a store, we thank you, but if you're interested in a store location, um, now would be the time to let us know so that we could go ahead and get you aligned with the store location 
and try to get your stores filed accordingly as well. HEB does have a couple of requirements to be in the store. You will be working directly with the store manager, the pharmacy manager, and what's considered the store champions. Each pharmacy has two. Um, so with that said, you want to introduce yourself basically to the store manager, the pharmacy manager, and their staff, as well as the store champions. These will be the people who will help you um, get the right position in the store location and also um, set up your table and provide you the things that you need for setup. So once you're in the store, we would like you to arrive a little bit earlier than your shift actually begins. So if your shift starts at the 9 a.m. hour, we would like to see you there at 8.30 for setup. And when you're ending at 1 o'clock, we'd like you to actually end about 1.15 to allow yourself to conclude and wrap up um, any cleanup and things of that nature so that you're actually there from 9 a.m. until the full hour of 1 p.m. We would like you to dress professionally. Um, I know it's hot in most of the states now, um, especially here in Texas. Um, it's, it's warming up, so we definitely want to encourage you to be business professional, so no jeans, no shorts, no sweats or t-shirts will be allowed, but business casual along with your name tag. And we do provide you guys a name tag. Also, we want you to refrain from using your cell phones or your laptops iPads, tablets, unless, of course, you're using that for a prospective uh, member or you're looking up um, something that may be pertinent to their information. And, of course, if you were to have an emergency, surely you may need to use your cell phone. But to sit there and peruse your cell phone or play word games, we really want you to refrain from that so that you can be um, visible and approachable to your clients as they come towards you in the store. Um, wearing a smile is the best suggestion I can make to you because a smile can really go a long way and invite people over to your table as well. So your in-store setup, once you're actually in your HEB location, um, you'll work again, as I mentioned, with the store manager um, or the pharmacy manager to determine the best setup for your kiosk. Your kiosk meaning your table, kind of your booth. And so with that said, they'll supply you, they meaning HEB will supply you with a tablecloth, a table drape, and across the tablecloth is the table drape, which is similar to the picture here that says questions about health insurance, ask me. And it's just a um, kind of plastic um, banner that drapes across your, your tablecloth. And I'll show it to you here in a picture. So this slide here shows you a couple of opportunities where agents have displayed their tables as such. Um, so these are just some examples. The table that's at the top right corner, um, it has a pop-up banner behind its table. Um, we'd like to just suggest that you're cautious of your um, banners and such when they are displayed to make sure that they're not um, in an aisle way or um, intrusive to any of the um, clients as they walk around your table. So just be mindful of the positioning of how you place um, some of your, your loose signage so that it's not obstructive in any sort of way. And also when you're um, displaying your table, when you're setting up and, and taking your items down as well, um, you may want to pull a basket from the front end and then that way you can contain all of your um, items into maybe a, a shopping cart. And that way it can help you kind of dismantle um, your table a little more effectively and then keep everything contained as well. Okay, so these are a couple of slides, pictures as I mentioned just to show you some setup options. We also have what's called an agent checklist, and so this would include your business card. We just have a generic copy of, of what would be a business card here, say your agent name, your licensed agent, which would be the description of your job title, and then your telephone number, your email address, and so forth. So your business card should be applicable and fine, so you don't have to make any changes to your business card per se. We also have a display of what the name tag looks like. So it says, hello, my name is. It has your name, licensed sales representative, and then it has both the Brokerage Inc. and the HEB logos as well. 
We also have a, a sign that says we're here to help, and this sign is, is customizable, so you can change it for your days and your hours accordingly. So if you're there from Tuesdays and Thursdays from 9 to 1, it's applicable. But if you choose to do additional days, times, or hours, you can change that accordingly. The United Healthcare Company is a great partner. They've um, made um, the agent toolkit accessible to you as a credential certified agent. So as a United Healthcare agent, you can go into what they call their agent toolkit and you can print out unbranded marketing materials to use as collateral um, at your, your table kiosk. So I'll take you to the next slide here that shows a few examples of what they call the unbranded generic Medicare flyer. And they also have a second version of that. They have this available in English, Spanish, and other dialects as well. They're all customizable, so you're able to um, put in your agent name, your contact information accordingly, and then this is something you could display on your table. They're typically eight and a half by 11, so if you used a standing acrylic kind of the picture frame, this would be a really nice display. You could display this at your table with the permission of the pharmacy. You could also display it, say, at the pharmacy countertop as well. Okay, so just a few examples. This goes into further display of the agent toolkit just to give you a, a closer image of how a proof could look. And it um, has kind of contact me. I don't know if you can see that bottom right hand corner there, but it has contact me. And then um, John Dubas, our VP of sales and, and marketing, he placed his information there. So you can see that they would have his contact information. So it allows for you to kind of proof um, your document, check your spelling and so forth, and then you can print them and produce them. So it's actually at no cost um, to access the site once you're a certified agent with United Healthcare. The only cost to you would be the cost of using your printer. So if you're going to print them in color per se, that would be the only cost you would incur. <clears throat> Also, um, several um, kind of form letters that you guys can use. Um, we have lead cards that are available as well. So these are items that we can get to you guys. So if you're working in HEB location, as an example, and you're waiting for your store to be filed, um, when I say store filing, CMS has a compliance requirement that all Medicare um, activity has to be filed in a certain amount of days. So typically with United Healthcare, it's 21 days. It can range from 14 days to 21 days, um, but we'd like to just use the, the 21 just to be on the safe side. But you can definitely um, accept lead cards in the interim. So if you're working a kiosk, a table, and you have a client that approaches you, you can't necessarily write the application on the spot unless your, your you know, station has been completely um, filed in the 21-day allotment, but if it's not yet filed, then you can surely take a lead card, um, you could do a scope of appointment, and you could even schedule an off-site appointment with them, so you could maybe have an in-home session with them as well. So we have um, information that can help you, such as the lead cards with that. When we here at the brokerage um, maybe spot check your store location, um, this is a form in which we use. So we may come over, take a look at your store, visit with the store manager, and gain some information such as um, was your table set up, did you have the Medicare components at your location, depending on where you're located. Again, you may sell Baylor, Scott, and White. You may represent Memorial Hermann, um, depending on your area of Texas. Or you may have just the traditional products of United Healthcare, um, Blue Cross Blue Shield. Aetna, Transamerica, and a, and a few others. Okay, so this is just kind of a, a agent checklist that we use here at the brokerage. As I mentioned, CMS does have compliance requirements, so this gives you an example of the United Healthcare 21 day in advance um, compliance requirement I mentioned. So again, if you're looking to um, host an event, have a location, the store location that is, you would have to file it 21 calendar days in advance. Even if you make a cancellation, um, you you know know that there's a uh, you know family event coming up, and maybe you're going to have to travel for the Fourth of July holiday, and you're going to be out of office in the business days that surround the Fourth of July. 
then you may have to do a cancellation. So if that was your example, then you would need to cancel your event 14 days in advance. So this document here kind of outlines and displays um, the using of this form, the change or the cancel request guidelines, and then it has a couple of frequently asked questions as well. The nice thing about United Healthcare, they do have a producer help desk, which is a 1-800 number. So if you're ever um, in, in doubt of any of the processes, you can contact us here at the brokerage, or you could simply um, contact the producer help desk at their 1-800 number. And then they also have an email address, which is phd at uhc.com. So that's the producer help desk at unitedhealthcare.com. <clears throat> this gives an example of how that form looks for Blue Cross Blue Shield. So again, they um, also have a file requirement, and that's going to be a 10-day advance file notice. It requires you to complete um, a couple of items, such as the location, the time, the date, your personal information, and the event type. We typically call these informal events so that um, they're, they're not um, so heavily shopped by CMS. The informal event allows for you to sell and also educate um, at your event. So that way, if you do have a sales opportunity, you can capture it. Otherwise, you can provide educational information. This is an example of the Aetna filing, which is 14 days in advance. So similar to Blue Cross Blue Shield, it has the time, date, location, and so forth that you would complete. This one represents the Baylor Scott and White, which is 14 days. And we could continue to show you examples, but each of our companies, Memorial Hermann, I think they have a 10-day advance notice. We can um, help you here at the brokerage to determine how to file your event. So our second partner up for retail is our United Healthcare partner. So United Healthcare um, is sold in all of our venues and locations, okay, um, such as HEB, our Walmart locations that we'll talk about next, and then United Healthcare has their own program details. So when you're set up with a United Healthcare exclusive opportunity as such, you would only sell their portfolio of products, whether it's Medicare or Affordable Care Act products. They would have you um, connected to what they call Be Connected, which is the system filing for the CMS reporting. You would also have um, activity reports that would be due through the Be Connected system, and you would work directly with the Brokerage Inc. as well as the local area rep for United Healthcare um, for your area. So they do provide a kiosk stand. We'll take a look at um, a copy or picture rather of a kiosk stand. Again, the agent toolkit would be a great source of information for you because it would offer all of your um, materials, enrollment kits, all of the marketing collateral pieces could be ordered accordingly at no cost to you besides the cost of printing. And as I mentioned, they have a um, multiple um, selection of, of languages for their, um, for their literature as well, for their marketing pieces. So anything from Spanish, Vietnamese, Chinese, um, Korean, they have all of the different dialects available um, for selection. So depending on where you're located, um, your language of preference as well, this may be applicable to you in your area. So it's, it's very... Um, easily accessed through the agent toolkit. They have signs of operations, um, returning shortly signs if you need to take a quick break. They have your retail event calendar to show the days of the week that you're at your location. So there's a multitude of, of signs and, and items that you can use to display at your kiosk, which will definitely help um, for, for the, the flow of business at your location. Even when you're not at your location, you can kind of self-advertise when you will be back because your kiosk can remain as a permanent setting at the location. So again, this just gives more about the language um, that's available. So we'll kind of go through these so I can show you um, how the table kiosk looks. So this gentleman is standing at a Kroger location outside of the Dallas area. And this is just an example of how his booth looks at that location for United Healthcare. 
as I mentioned again, compliance is really big. So this is kind of a do's and a don'ts list here. It has informal marketing sales events, um, kind of what you must do and what you must not do. So the do's and don'ts. Um, I won't go through each line item here because it's fairly lengthy. But what I will suggest um, after the call is concluded this morning, I will send this information to you in its entirety. This entire recording um, or information is recorded. So you can review this if you like to. Okay, so we'll just go through this one, um, and as I mentioned, more collateral pieces such as banners, um, dual eligible posters, and banners are all customizable and available at the United Healthcare Toolkit. So if you want to really customize your event, you really can. Here's an example of a stand-up banner sign. Um, this has got Medicaid, got Medicare A and B get additional benefits, learn more today. So again, this is one of the pop-up banners that may be displayed, but again, um, make sure that this is, is displayed in close proximity to your kiosk um, so that it's not intrusive in any aisles, things of that nature as customers walk past. Okay, so um, this is an opportunity where we have a lead card collection station pre-orders. So it's open for um, the United Healthcare product for $195. It includes shipping and handling. Um, it features a lead box, two pockets for your trifold brochures. The business cards can be attached. You can attach pins, lead cards, and um, it's just your entire setup. So again, if you're interested in the United Healthcare product and locations and venues, we may still have some available in your area. So just simply let us know here at the brokerage as soon as today and we can get you set up with the United Healthcare product. Okay? So let's talk about our next partner which is Direct Health. They actually sponsor our Walmart opportunity. So Walmart are actually across the country. So they're not going to be limited to just the state of Texas. They are across the country. So if I have other states on the call today, thank you so much for joining us as well because we do have opportunities for you. Um, United Healthcare products are across the country as well. As I just mentioned, the United Healthcare plans, but Walmarts are statewide and across the country. So marketing products through the brokerage inc directly. We would like you to have three Medicare carriers and two affordable health care carriers to participate. Now this is a more um, open enrollment period, so this will begin towards the October season for open enrollment. It will go all the way until the end of January to include the Affordable Care Act programs. And again, it's sponsored by Direct Health, but it's available at Walmart locations. So agents would have a direct cost with this program. If you are interested in it, we will have our list for the Walmart locations um, going forward for the fall. So you can go ahead and start to claim your locations as soon as today if you like. So please let us know. There's um, currently not an actual Walmart available at this time, but again, we would like you to be prepped and ready if you want a Walmart location for open enrollment. The Aetna Opportunity is one of our newest partners. Um, we joined forces with Aetna late fall last year. And so they are provided with DMS Marketing, which is their kind of um, marketing engine. They do everything which is web-based enabled. So you can order your materials, your marketing collateral, um, all the things you would need to be successful at your location. You can place orders for them through their portal. It does have a direct cost involved. And again, this is more of an open enrollment product. So we'll have more details and um, disclaimers on this program as we get closer to the open enrollment. But just to give you an example, some of the Edna retail locations may include in your area a Kroger location, a Walgreens location, or if you have the Albertson stores in your area. So um, they have some different retail store opportunities, a little bit of a mixture of um, opportunities for locations. 
the last program I'd like to talk about is what we call our grassroots self-generated program. So kind of a DIY, do-it-yourself. Um, we encourage all of our agents to consider faith-based community um, operations such as your church, your parks and recreation center, senior centers, and senior residents. Nowadays, there's a lot of seniors who live in active retirement communities, whether it's um, condos, townhomes, or even apartments. So to become familiar with those um, areas and outfit yourself there so that you can communicate with maybe the program directors or, or um, the property you know, leadership team and so forth so that you can go in and make yourself um, known to that community and maybe host events. So you can drive your own leads. Um, we do have carrier support where sometimes our carriers provide us leads as well. But we want to let you know that this is an opportunity where you can use direct mail. You can use your local newspaper or even produce flyers and kind of work the community. So if you have any questions on grassroots marketing, please let us know. We actually do a separate um, webinar call on kind of how to partner with the brokerage. I'll be hosting that call today at 11 o'clock. So if you're interested, you can dial back into our 11 o'clock call on how to partner with the brokerage. And I'll be going through some lead opportunities and ways in which you can um, self-generate leads as well. So if this program sounds um, interesting or attractive to you, please let us know here at the brokerage. You can contact us at our main number. You can visit us at our website. Um, but either way, we'd like to hear from you. We've made contracting really simple where you can simply click on our link from our main home page and get contracted today, meaning that you would let us know who you are and what you're interested in. So it requires a voided check. We at the brokerage, we do offer E&O coverage for programs in which we offer directly. So if you're um, new to us, if it's your first time contracting with, say, United Healthcare, and you need E&O coverage for um, the United Healthcare product, as an example, we can offer that to you at no cost. Now, if you're a, a current agent who's already had a contract and have you know coverage in place, we definitely don't want you to lose the previous coverage um, for products that may not be directly with the brokerage. So, if you have any questions on that, please let us know. Now, we do have a contracting team of ladies who can help you as well: Laura, Ebony, or Samantha. Um, or just a phone call away, so you can reach any of them at their direct phone numbers, as well as you can call us at our 1-800-442-4915 number, and any of them can be accessible as well. So if you have any um, stumbling blocks when it comes to contracting, any generic questions on contracting, or just need to um, you know, complete anything online per se, they can kind of go behind the scenes and look where you are online as well as help you um, via telephone. So please call us. If you're interested in growing your portfolio of products, we have an assortment of products. So anywhere from annuities, dental vision, group products, individual major medical, international travel insurance, long-term care insurance, life insurance, supplemental, and of course, Medicare. So if you're looking to grow your portfolio of items, reach out to us. Let us know. We'd love to um, help you expand and cross-sell into other areas as well. Um, that's also a good way to self-generate leads. And um, if we can be of any assistance there, we would definitely like to talk to you about how you can maybe fill the gaps in some of your clients' existing coverage as well. Oftentimes, standalone dental plans go a really long way um, when you have a sales opportunity with Medicare or affordable health care. We have what's called our training center. You can find that under our tools selection at thebrokerageinc.com. And under our training session, you'll find um, previously recorded webinars, PowerPoint presentations that are available for use, and also any live training events that we have in the area. So depending on where you're, you're located, whether it's one of the major metroplexes in the Texas market, such as San Antonio, Austin, Dallas, Fort Worth, or Houston and its surrounding areas, we're hosting live events um, each calendar month. So we typically have what we call lunch and learns or coffee and chat sessions, and we would love to see you at one in person. You can also visit our website under the calendars tool, and under calendars you can see our events if they're listed as well. 
<clears throat> we do recommend a couple of trainings, whether it's the carrier trainings, Medicare supported or affordable health care supported, so that you can become proficient in those areas. We also offer additional um, retail training. We do this particular retail call each, um, or I should say every other Wednesday, so bi-weekly. And as we get closer to the open enrollment season, we will do this call weekly. So we'll share best practices. We'll open the telephone lines for questions and, and um, concerns as well. And it's something weekly that we can all benefit from as we all work the retail opportunities across the nation. We also have, um, as I mentioned, tutorials and website support. We encourage what I was mentioning, the grassroots marketing, working your community. We have a couple of trainings on the low income subsidy, Medicare savings plans, and we also have training on both Medicare supplement engine and what we call the decision maker. So we would encourage you guys to use plan finders um, and, and things like the decision maker so that when you're working with your clients, you can make sure that all their coverages or, or, or needs have been um, addressed, as well as fill in any gaps with any of our dental, vision, hearing, or ancillary products that you can possibly offer. As I mentioned, we do have um, ancillary products, things that kind of fill in the gaps. So this is just an example. Medico is one of our partners. They offer um, really ease at enrollment. It's a combo e-application, so you as an agent can do everything online. It allows you to kind of fill in the gaps of dental, vision, or hearing for your clients. And that's just as an example of one of the many products that we have that can fill in some holes that your clients may incur. So if any of this sounded, um, you know, like a really great opportunity for you and you can't wait to get started, we can't wait for you to start. So we'd love to hear from you. So to become involved, let us know. Simply give us a call, 1-800-442-4915. Um, you can contract appropriately. We have, again, Laura, Ebony, and Samantha, who are our contracting specialists. They will help you get certified and, and, and credentialed for the products in which you're interested in. Since we all have a different portfolio of products, everyone is different. But we can help you to um, study the materials, prepare for the market, and engage in opportunity. So we want you to be successful with the brokerage. We want to offer you programs such as the retail opportunities so that it can enhance your business and, and grow your portfolio in general. So again, if you're interested, our contact numbers are listed here. And again, if you don't have pen or paper, no worries. This information will be sent to you in its entirety. But we have Christina Guerrero, who's our program coordinator for um, the market. So if you're interested, Christina works with any of us in all of our areas, so you can let her know. Or if you're specific to South Central Texas, such as Austin, Corpus Christi, um, San Antonio, the Rio Grande Valley area, we have Claudia who represents that area and you can contact her directly. If you're interested in the Houston, Beaumont, East Texas um, and surrounding counties, myself, Kim, um, I'm available for you. And then we have John Dubas who's out of our Dallas-Fort Worth office and he covers nationwide opportunities as well. So as I mentioned, Walmarts are nationwide opportunities. The United Healthcare product directly is a nationwide opportunity as well. So we would encourage you guys to take a look at all of this information, decipher which would be best for you, and we would love to hear from you. So I'd like to take a quick look to see if we have any questions in my questions box first before we release the line this morning. And I, I do not see any questions, um, but if by chance you have a question that surfaces a little bit um, later on today after the presentation, again, please call us. Let us know. We're here to help and we definitely want to hear from you. So I'd like to say thank you for coming on to the line today. Um, <clears throat> I will send this information in its entirety to your inbox, so you can look for that within the next two hours or so. And I'd like to say thank you. We look forward to hearing from you soon. If we can be of any service, please give us a call, 1-800-442-4915. You guys take care, and we'll look to hear from you in about two weeks when we repeat um, this particular retail call. Thank you and have a great day. Bye-bye.